this time, please direct your attention to center court and help me welcome back to Tucson, Arizona letter winner, Terry Francona. <laughs> Director of Athletics, Greg Byrne. Uh, Deputy Director of Athletics, Rocky LaRose. Arizona baseball head coach, Andy Lopez. Retired coaches, Jerry Kindle, Jerry Stitt, Jim Wang and College Baseball Hall of Fame Executive Director Mike Gustafson are here today to recognize an incredible accomplishment in Terry's career. On July 3rd in Lubbock, Texas, Terry Francona was inducted into the College Baseball Hall of Fame for his remarkable accomplishments while playing at Arizona. As an outfielder from 1978 to 1980, Terry was named a National Player of the Year in 1980 and was awarded the Golden Spikes Award, and he is the only Arizona baseball letter winner to have ever received this award. For two years, 1979 and 1980, he led the Pac-10 South in hits, RBIs, and doubles in his career. He was also named First Team All-American by the American Baseball Coaches Association, the Sporting News, and Collegiate Baseball. In 1980, he was named Most Outstanding Player at the College World Series after helping to lead the Wildcats to the national title. In 2004, Terry was hired to manage the Boston Red Sox and led the team that year to its first World Series championship since 1918. He followed up that historic championship with another Boston World Series championship in 2007, and in 2011, Terry joined ESPN's Sunday Night Baseball telecast. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a big round of applause to Arizona letter winner and Hall of Famer Terry Francona. Thank you very much. I can't believe I'm the only person that hasn't aged in this building. It's such an honor to be back, be on campus and be back home. I got a chance to visit with the baseball team today. Please support them in their new at High Corbett. And go, bear down, go Cats. Thank you. 